Hello, my great and wonderful people. We welcome you once again to our today's episode of this program. And today we get this message on our table again when it be said with the receive from this outspoken Yoruba man when it be said in name na Sunday Igbo. This man don't vow say in as much as full any has me say they not go allow peace to reign for Yoruba land. He himself don't also vow say he not go give them peace as well. And the title of this one talk say. Take full any hesme out of Yoruba land or there will be trouble. This one and the message when the BC Yoruba nation agitator when the BC in name now Sunday Igbo go tell Buhari. And this new reach our table January 19th, 2021. And also for the course of the program, we'll see the review to on one or two videos when the BC is still concerned these people as well. We just there when I say, could not patient with us. And in case today on the first day when the BC they hear about us on the channel, be this, we say you are highly welcome. I bet make you not forget to help us hit that subscribe button. And also the small bell when the BC they near and so that anytime when the BC will take bring a new update, you know, we discover to look for it will only come to you like a message. And our prayer, remember, be say, they say we want to be say, they support us on the channel. And they say we want God with the same people when we will support you for everything when it's good, when you put your hands to do in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. With that, we don't waste any of our time again. We'll just do one or two readings, then we'll conclude together for the comment session. And as we put our hand there for inside this matter, the comic us understand, say, an agitator for Odua Republic when it be say in name na Sunday at the Yemo, when it be say the popularly known as Sunday Igbo, say he don't call on the Nigeria government to evacuate Fulani Hessmen from the southwest to prevent escalation of tension. And still on top of the matter, the comic us understand say Igbo he disclosed this very message for the recent video when it be say he did for circulation for social media. And a get it say anything when it be say it concern this country, Nigeria, say it not concern now. The only thing when it be say it concern now, now the issue when it be say it concern Ododua nation. And also it can call upon other patriots to join her to fight for the liberation of Ododua. When it be said they always they refer to as Yoruba people collectively. And they get the contour say as this man they speak for Yoruba language, it talks say, you know, if it discuss anything when it be say it consigned the country, when it be say it they cheat Yoruba people. And again, in contour say, we when it be Yoruba people, make we make sure say we come together as one to send these people back come for our own land because no other person will feel doing for us. Our senators, when they say they're supposed to help us, all of the Sudan, they look these people, this full and they kill our medical daughters when they say they struggle, go abroad, go study. And they also kill one woman when they say it struggle, build her own Philly station and every other good, good things when they say the day for Yoruba land when it be say it not supposed to be so. And still on top of the matter, the comic us understand say this Igbo, he can talk say he believe and he know say Yoruba elder say they not they happy with this killing when it be say it they happen for the land so. Say however he challenged them, say made they do video to pledge their own support for the killings of this Fulani headers for Yoruba land. And again, he can talk say he they show say the Kabye say they're not they happy with the killings as well. Say if he be say truly say that they happy for what they happen, say he challenge them as well. Say made they do video to say what in they their mind. And he can talk say they're not they happy, but they're not go feel wear this battle armor, which is to say to confront to say they want go for this very world to confront these very people. Say we the ones when they be say they will do this very thing. So say may they support us to go ahead to do what in they our mind to make sure say we save guy this our land. And for us to conclude this matter, he can talk say he won for the impending doom when he be say it will be for this full and he me. If he be say they don't leave the place when he be say that they call it Barakba by Friday, January 24th, 2021. All right, my great and wonderful people. Now, only this one will fit take from this news when he be say it they come from this Sunday Igbo. When he be say it they send a sound warning. To the federal government of Nigeria, led by President Muhammad Buhari, say make measures say he remove all the Fulani hessmen from Yoruba land, or else they face the reggae dance when they say it will follow very soon. Now, in be this very one. And before we leave, Unana make una share una opinion with us for the comment session. We want to first of all say may God bless this man. And may God bless everybody when they be say is still they like minded with this Sunday. Igbo when they be say they know the pain of their people. 
honestly. Not because of his own family, if they do this one, if they do one because of waiting in eye, they see when they say if they confront his own people for their own land, when they say they're supposed to get peace, they're supposed to live in peace. When they say these very intruders, these people, when they say they come from nowhere, just invade their land, they give their head, they kill them on a daily basis. You see? Now, waiting. Every good citizen when they say they really get their people for heart, supposed to they do. I think day before yesterday we also make a publication of your own video how it take go invade. I think on your state, yes, where all these Fulani herdsmen they take their own hideout when they say they take they commit all the kidnapping and everything. It lead the youth go there, go invade the place. Right now, it never see stop. I believe right from the one, this man, they outstanding. Now, one man squad, when he be say, he know the pain of a people. Now, waiting every individual, when he be say, yes, they really understand what the time talk, supposed to be engaged by this very time. Because this will not be the time when he be say, we're supposed to be, even they look up to the federal government. Let us assume now, say, we not get federal government of Nigeria. We not get. Honestly, we not get. Because I think this morning we also read news how this federal government of Nigeria they sent a warning to the governor of all those states when they be say in name Narotimi Akere Dulu when they be say he still issued the same warning to the Fulani Hesme say by on Friday may all of them vacate all those states. They warn them, you understand me? They go warn the governor say why he will send that kind of message. And we still also read the news again, I think yesterday as well, how this group when they be say that they come yet the Allah Cattle Breeders Association. Also, still send a sad warning to this same governor as well. When they said that they battle their back and front. All this was supposed to show to us say, we don't get anybody when they say we look up to, like the federal government or the security agencies of Nigeria to say, okay, they want to bring peace for all this calamity when they say they happen for the land. This one at the time for self defense, individual defense, group defense. Try anything when you say you feel do to protect your life and the one of your family. Yes, anywhere when you say fire for quench, we, 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 we go like that. So how one do? It's better for you to stand to defend yourself, make you die for the process, than you close your hand, they expect unexpected to come, than you die for there. You understand me? Because if you fold your hand, wait, the, the death will still come. If you defend yourself, if God say, okay, now there it will still come, make it come for there. So now what me I see for all this whole issue now in be this one and the time now in be this very one. All right, before we go further, you get this video when they say I will live on and make on a watch. We'll come back for the conclusion. Let's let's go back to your younger brother, Victor Banjo, who was in the military mm -hmm. during the Civil War. Mm -hmm. Do you think that Victor, your brother, was right to be on the side of uh, the Afra during the war? Well, he, I wasn't surprised that he was on the side of Biafra, and he said his reason why he was on the side of Biafra. What reason was that? First of all, he and Ujuku were friends here. They both were graduates in the army. They both had... I, I wrote a book about it, I, and I launched a book about it. Uh, and uh, they, they both were... What shall I say? The the active, uh, active group that wants independence for Nigeria, who, when the, the boy did the coup, he wasn't part of them. Instead, he, he was in Lagos then, he was head of the, um, I think, of the, of the engineering corps. Instead, he, he risked his life, went around trying to stabilize the army in Lagos. And, and they wrote the statement for uh, Ironsi that he, would, he should make uh, to, to calm the situation. In fact, the boys who did the coup wanted him to take over because he was educated, he was a graduate. And, and he said, no, we must all follow Ironsi because he was, uh, he was the head of the army and was rally running and keep the hierarchy in the army so that there won't be a civil war. But somehow, somewhere down the line, we don't know what happened. Ironsi suddenly arrested him. As it, so it was Ironsi who detained him in the east. 
he wrote to Gawain to say that we should try and settle this. Then Iransi got killed. Abi, wasn't that? He was assassinated. He yes. was assassinated. He wasn't part of the group that assassinated. He had uh, a, a, a statement where he gave a reason where he supported uh, Biafra. That after they had massacred them in the north and in the east, they again invaded them to come to there. And so he, he felt that somebody ought to, pro and he was protesting about it. That was why he, he joined Ujuku. He was the only engineer in the army, and, uh, and he orga organized them so that they could repel the northerners. The, the, my point of resentment came only when Ujuku killed my brother, executed my brother, because I said, ah, this man who saved you, who helped train you, organize and train your army, and who helped you re resist the onslaught of the 